Welcome to another edition of Ask Nappy. I'm Abhinav Girdha, founder of Happy Pie. Today's question comes from Jane from Birmingham, United Kingdom, and she is a secondary school teacher in Birmingham. And she asked if she could use Happy Pie's website builder to create a quiz website for her pupil. Yes, Jane, with Happy Pie's website builder, you can certainly create a website for your students and you can add different type of quizzes. We have a comprehensive quiz feature. In order to do that, you need to go into our Happy Pies website builder, add that quiz or a poll feature as we call it in within your website. Once you have added that feature, you can then decide how you want to start creating your quiz. Do you want to categorize it? At Happy Pies quiz feature, we give you the option to categorize your quizzes into different categories. So, or you could straight away add one default category and directly start adding quiz, or you can categorize if you have uh, 50 odd different quizzes that you wish to add and they're all from different categories it could be math it could be English it could be sciences then you can categorize them so let's assume uh, for the sake of this discussion that you are actually wanting to categorize it so let's first add categories to your quiz and then let's talk about English let's talk about English quiz you are actually adding we support different type of questions it could be a multiple choice question in the multiple choice question, we also allow you to add media. It could be an image or it could be a video that you could incorporate and the user needs to see that video clipping or an image, then choose which answer is the right answer. It could be uh, one answer that could be a correct or it could be more than one answer that might be correct. We also allow you to add a question, sort of a, uh, add a question where we give you a text area so you put a question and the user has a big text area where he can actually enter the text. So different types of questions are actually uh, part of our quiz feature. We also allow you to add instructions uh, prior to the quiz being started. So for example, when the end student is actually coming onto your website and he's trying to attempt the quiz, there is a set of instruction that comes in and the student reads that set of instructions before attempting the quiz. We also have the option for the quiz to be a time-bound quiz or it could be a limitless or a timeless sort of a quiz. Uh, you could add scoring options, you cannot have scoring options, well, we have given you that choice as well. Another option is if you want to show the answer at that particular juncture when the person is attempting the quiz or you want to show the answer at the end. We also support a leaderboard feature. So in the leaderboard, what happens is if about 70 students you have who are attempting the quiz, we can tell you who is the leader, who has attempted and who has got the highest score uh, in that specific quiz. So you can attempt that as well. We also give you quiz analytics in the back end, which gives you details how much time a particular individual or an average is taking to do the quiz. What are the average score? So there is a lot of features that are there to choose from, to analyze from in a quiz and the full feature that we have created. So definitely go and explore it, see the quiz, you know, create the quiz that best suits your requirement and I'm pretty sure that you'll be happy with the end results. If you like this edition, then do share it on social media networks like Facebook and Twitter and do remember to subscribe to our channel below.